Welcome back, guys. Today we're playing these lovely two $5 tickets to try and find our symbol. So if you haven't been following us up until now, we've been trying to go on a symbol hunt to find symbols. We've gotten some wins this week, but we've only found one symbol so far. And our goal is to make that change today. So today we're playing these lovely two. Uh, this one's the one million left and the gold rush classic five dollar ticket. My dad wants to play this one first. So we're gonna read up all the rules on this lovely ticket. We're looking for a number match, a five times or ten times symbol, a gold bar for a five hundred dollar automatic win, that'd be nice, and a money bag for a twelve prize win all. So we're gonna try and find one of those symbols. If not, a number match would be just as awesome. So my dad's gonna get started and we'll explain how to play the other ticket when we get to that little ticket. Starting it off with number two. He's um, he's done this all week, so if you haven't seen, he's been going for the prize um, numbers first and not our numbers. So pretty much the same thing all week as he has scratched for us. We've got number two, number 34, number one. Oh, I didn't see that one. Uh, number 15, number 24, number 27. Number 11, number 7, good old, oh, good old, lucky number 4, number 19, number 16, and one more chance for a symbol. Nope, and we got number 28. So no symbols, but we can still go for a number match. We're starting off with good old number 9. I know I did not say that number. Number 30. We only have 34. Number 6. Nope, no number 6. And lastly, number 3. So it looks like to me nothing on that lovely ticket, but we have this lucky one million luck or whatever you want to call it. And this one is a bunch of symbol tickets, but we're looking for specific symbols. So we're looking for a horseshoe, a, a horseshoe for an automatic win. I wasn't even going to explain it. A clover for five times the prize, and a pot of gold for a twelve prize win all. So this one I have not won on ever, and I've played it, I think, I think I've played it twice, and my dad's played it twice, and we've never won on it. So we're going to get started, it's quite simple, horseshoe, clover, or a pot of gold. There's no numbers to it, so we're literally looking for those things. We started off with a briefcase, we have a ring-a-ding-ding, -ding. what is this? Is that? Oh, a gift. Okay, sorry. I was like, what is that? A piggy bank. I don't know. It looked like a building, but it wasn't a building. What is this? What is that? Oh, a bank roll. Okay. Wow. That's so weird. I mean, I knew it wasn't a winner, but I just. Okay. A purse. A lovely diamond. Remember what we have to get. A wallet, horseshoe, clover, or um, gold, pot of gold. A check. There's a gold nugget. A golden nugget. Gold nugget. Gold nugget. That is a crown. And last but not least, a credit card. So no one on that one, no one on this one, obviously those had tons of symbols, but that doesn't count as finding a symbol. Um, so far we've only found one symbol this week, I'm glad we did because so far we've only found one. Um, but we've had more than one win, so if you didn't see those, go check them out and see all the ones that we've had leading up to this point. Next week I may be playing just double the same ticket, so I might get like two of these play them in a row instead of um, one of each but I decided to do it this way 
this week because I knew I was going to stop at two different gas stations. So next week I probably won't have time to do that, but um, so I might just do two, which will give us a little bit more of an advantage of finding a symbol or a win. So if you are doing this lovely challenge of symbol hunting and finding symbols, please let me know down in the comments below so I can make sure to go and check your videos out and see how you're doing on this lovely video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.